Evangelist Davis. For those that don't know, I don't go on, is it Instagram? I don't go on Instagram. Is it Twitter? I don't go on Periscope at all. I don't go on Periscope. I don't hang on Periscope. I don't got no business over there. <laughs> but God took me over there one day. And I saw this young girl on fire talking about, my God, my God. <laughs> and she was all stirred up. And the young people was just getting it. And I asked her, to come to the network. And she became the very first evangelist hmm. to come to the Glory Network. Amen. And she was the very first woman to preach on the Glory Network. Hallelujah. So, out of obedience from God, we had to have her come to minister. Yes. I want to take time to thank all of these wonderful people. We're Bridget. <laughs> Flew all the way from Los Angeles, California. <laughs> come here to be a part of this network. And I can't forget my sister in the spirit, <laughs> Pastor Green. Her anointed dance and husband that's <laughs> dancing over there when they be ministering the word of God. And then I cannot forget this anointed young lady, Prophetess Deborah, yeah. who came here from Lake Norman. And I just thank you so much for coming tonight. And we can't forget Bishop C. Amen. I'll say this. This man of God has ministered to me and my wife, and he is a, definitely a, somebody y'all need to listen to on the radio. If y'all haven't heard him, you've got to hear his ministry. Amen. I would like to thank Gary Childs for coming to the conference tonight. And Apostle Chris. For those that don't know, this man right here, I met him through Brian Carn. Brian Carn introduced me to this man. And I'm just so grateful that he took the time to come out tonight. And I see Elder James is here from Las Vegas. He drove from Atlanta though. And when God told me to start the network, she was the one that I called. And it was her and I that prayed. And I said, God want me to start a radio station? I'm on the radio, but he want me to open it. And she said, build it, and he will fill it. Come on. Mm. Amen. And boy, has God been filling it. <laughs> I'm not going to forget Pastor Walker. I want to acknowledge you for flying in from Tennessee just to be in our midst and share us with all that worship. For those that don't know, she does have a CD and she does minutes all over the radio all day long, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And my good friend Ella, who is Sky's mother, I thank her for coming. I've been friends with her. We used to work a job together, and I didn't want to say where we worked, but when I went in there the other day, I was like, ooh. I was like, we used to work here. But God raised us up and gave us something better. Amen. And I'd like to thank Ella's parents for coming. I can't, I'm sorry I was in here earlier, but I had, I was just working, so I'm, when this is done, I'm gonna come out and meet y'all. Just apologize. I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to be rude. I'm just trying to work on whatever was going on. Well, I know that Hampton is here in the building. I see her. Will your husband come? 
Okay. We have Prophetess Steffi Bailey, who drove here from Hampton, Virginia. Thank you so much for coming. And I see a couple co-workers that's here from Wells Fargo.